when the BBC proposed pivoting my series, Antiques Roadshow, to more digital-friendly content, I told them I will have a smallish crowd from Sussex watch me sodomize myself with a hand-carved Jacobean replica of my own Johnson before I'd see that happen. Enter my relentless foe, the tax man. So now, instead of brutalizing myself with an oak dildo, I regrettably invite you to hate watch Nifty Roadshow, where self-appointed nerds evaluate non-fungible tokens, commonly known as NFTs or nifties. I don't care to know the first thing about it, but Gareth in catering assures me it's solid AF, which given that it's a bubble on the internet is fucking ludicrous. Hello, I'm Rudiger Hamforth, and welcome to my own personal hell. And I just stepped in a shit. I've not been on the telly before. Like, so. Rudiger and I are now joined by Monica, who, up until moments ago, was simply strolling the grounds before catching my eye with a little treasure. Now, Monica, can you please tell us about said treasure? Well, it's just... I'm going to stop you right there, because here we have a 7th century Tang Dynasty doily. And you see, I simply love how the crochet style has been perfectly 3D rendered to show the natural little cotton bumps. You yeah, see the great uncle Nigel brought it across from Taiwan. It was uh, 18, yes, yes, it was 18 days ago. And I've just had it sitting there gathering dust on the blockchain. Brilliant backstory, yeah. brilliant. It's so this is a nifty, is it? It's, it's a <clears throat> photograph in a code. This non-fungible token is a unique piece of art that has been encoded on the blockchain, giving it tremendous value because it cannot be forged. Nige bought it for 39p. 39p? Yeah, what, what do you reckon it's worth? Well, I think you're in for a shock, Monica, because that 39p could now be worth... Anywhere from nothing to fuck all, I'd 60, say. pounds. 60,000 pounds. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> right. Well, I don't make this stuff up. Christ on a cracker! <gasps> right. Oh, that's quite a lot of pounds. Let me get this straight. You... mashed up August Rodin's The Thinker with a man on a toilet. That's what Beth is looking at. Yeah, I call it the stinker. <laughs> Brilliant. And this literal piece of crap has financial value, does it? 12,000 pounds. Fuck! Oh, it has a plus one. Well, I suppose it has sentimental value or blackmail oh. value, but... Well, Amy, he don't like to get pruney, oh. doesn't he? Now, I'd say your nifty of this very private video could fetch 800, maybe 900. What about now? What's it worth now, hmm? What's it worth Ladies now? Ladies and gentlemen, by destroying the mm. physical copy, Rudiger has actually increased the value of the nifty. Oh. <laughs> oh. 1,100. 1,200! 1,500! That is a lot of pounds. That is, so keep a hold of this, baby. Oh, yes. I nearly lost it. Oh, and that's the trouble with real art. Well, it takes up space, I know. What? No, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? Come back here! That's mine! All right! Say I bought your nifty of Elon in the bath. <gasps> Beeple? Just put in a bid for 1,500. Beeple? What the fuck is a Beeple? Well, I'm gonna outbid him. Uh, 2,000. 2,000? Oh, no, 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 no. The code on the internet? Mona Lisa, just paint on a canvas. 2,200. No, I couldn't do that. It's just a bloody number. Who bids on a number? Wall Street, 2,500. No, no, I couldn't possibly. Don't no. get fucking smart with me, laddo. Say I paid 3,000. What, is that a bit? Well, don't you get my way, Rudiger. No. 3,500. No, 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 higher than that. Shut up, you fucking internet potatoes. You the money. <laughs> 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 
I fell in a shit again. Five thousand, and that's my final offer. <laughs> well, at least you can't make a living out of it. I mean, seriously, five thousand pounds. <laughs> well, five thousand Ethereum is six million pounds. Right. Well, now that we have finally burst through the thin veneer of reality and nothing has any meaning anymore, what about the deep fakes? What about them? Well, your video there of Elon in the bath, Jeff Bezos handing him the soap. I mean, seriously, the first time Bezos has been seen handing anything to anyone. Excuse me? Sir? Sir? Did, did he just... Scam you out of six million pounds? No, no, no. I don't want to repeat myself, but you can't forge a nifty. But it's a deep fake. That means the video is a fake. But the nifty is real. It's a fake. An authentic fake. Fake! Phony! Fraud! Forgery! Are you telling me that this is six million pounds worth of digital bullshit? That's right. Tax man! Six million pounds tax man! Tax man! It's on the blockchain. It's not inside the tablet. I don't know. He understands how the tech works. <laughs> oh, that's got to hurt. Join me next week when I saw my own head off in a public lavatory and hope that nobody makes a gip out of it. Oh, of course there's a bloody shit in here!